can see, uh, my build is now a little different. I, after almost 40 hours, I was kind of getting a little bored of the Katana playthrough. It was, it's kind of getting old, so decided to do something that I never finished playing a Dark Souls game with just a great sword. Oh, and for any of that, I want to say thank you to I think it's it's S H two Neely Sh two Neely for uh, following. I guess uh, while off stream, so thank you. But anyway, the plan is to start finishing some stuff up. And uh, to do that, we're going to have to hopscotch around some bosses. And uh, then I was told not overly politely that I was uh, being a huge baby and not doing the challenge areas in the DLC. So I'll try to put on my big boy pants and we'll head back there and do some of those. But the first order of business is uh, going into here, which is... I'll say more after I kill this guy. Yeah, I have a shield too now. What are you going to do about it? Nothing. This is the way to the final boss fight, but the way the game does, like, final bosses in this is a little weird. So... Uh, we won't be fighting the final boss right now. But we do have to fight a boss in here to get the last thingy-dingy I need for my build. Alright. Now we don't need that anymore. Put on... I am not sure how difficult this next boss is going to be because I'm going to... I don't want to say cheat. Cheat feels like the wrong word. But I am uh, going to be finishing up two NPC storylines, which means the gang is going to be all here. But this area is very cool an idea, but in practice, this feels a lot like uh, the area at the end of the, oh, I don't remember what it was called, but it was the DLC of Dark Souls 1. I think it was just called uh, Artorius of the Abyss. Gotta get some water. When you're walking down to fight Manus, so maybe that's what they're going for. I wish there was more stuff going on in the darkness. But, here we go. Should be a couple bros waiting for me up here. I see one and I see two! First of all, Head of Vengarl! Wolf bros. And then secondly, good old Ben! Oh, he uses a sword and shield. I thought he was going to use two swords. He's also a very big boy. So, uh, let's get to it, gentlemen. Are we all sword and shield bros? No, Ben Hart's a big boy who doesn't need a shield. So, yeah, it's going to be 2v3. Team... <laughs> so you kind of just want to keep them beat down together. Oh, they're both looking at me now. Shit. I need to do something in my inventory. Oh, I forgot. He does magic. I'm going to get your shield. No oh shit! <laughs> I got distracted by friendship. Oh shit. Oh, Ben Hart, no. Wow, 
Well, I don't think I can finish his storyline now, but that's fine with me. I don't really care. Ow. Ow, could you stop? Oh, shit, I died. Well, that's what I get for my hubris. For my hubris. And there is my voice. Alright, so. Well, on the, on the bright side, that means I get to try again with my buds. But how far did you guys end up getting in uh, your playthrough last night, uh, Casanova? Do I not? Cool. Nice. The Harvest Valley. You guys were doing some damage. Oh, covetous demon. Did he grab any of you in his mouth? Alright, let's try this again, but with less getting dunked on. One down. Kill him. Okay. And that little cutscene's gonna play, but I'm gonna run away like a big boy. So gross. Ew, don't make tentacle noises. Look how neato she is.
Oh, shit. I can't just... Oh, because of my phantoms. Well, get, get murdered. Wow, she's doing a lot of damage. I forgot they would stay here. Just kill them both. Yep, friendship. So how's your guys' day? It's one down. Get out of here, Vengarl. Alright, let me use that feather, please. Feather, please. Feather, please. <laughs> well, I hope the update is all that you ask for. Your cool hardcore modes and whatnot. Alright, let's head to Strayed Cell. I think he's the one that gives you this. Trade, my dude. Uh. Ah, shit. Do I have to go to Ornifex? Okay. I know I'm a disappointment. This bonfire is one of the worst put together bonfires. Well, I honestly very much enjoyed you guys playing Dark Souls last night, so if you end up just having to play Dark Souls for, like, 50 more hours, I'm fine with that. Stop shooting me with my jicks. Get in here, spiders. Spinny. Is that it? Is that all the spider? Ow. Any more spiders? No. shield that I want. Defender shield. Nice. Free shield. Back to the juju. Less damage, but it is better in all the defensive ways. Oh, but it is magic if you hit someone with it. It's also lighter. Alright, bud, I need you to upgrade my shit. With all of my petrified drag. Oh, it increases its defense a little bit. Oh, it does not increase stability like the other ones do. Oh, it does decrease stability. I'm crazy. I was looking at the other stuff. And... Boom! There we go. Alright, fully kitted out with all of the cool stuff. All the boys. And now we begin... The bossiest of rushes. First on the shit list is a big old Zambambo man. To the undead crypt. Ah.
But I think, I think your friend Kyle followed us last night. I just want to, if you could tell him thank you for me, that is a big help. But there we go. Anyone following me? Yes. Get out of here, aged feather. Here we go. This fight is pretty hard, if I remember, especially since I don't have all of the giant souls. Fight me, tall man. What is my volume on my headset? Oh, that's where I want it. Alright, here we go, Vendrick. I wonder how much damage I actually do to you. Damn it, stop moving. Oh, that was not very much. Oh! <laughs> that, oh, this is gonna be bad. went about as expected. This is not a fight where you really get many chances to drink. start though. I, now it'll just start in the fight and we can get going. I hopefully won't get butt crushed so hard. Uh, one of those days he's going to learn to do a horizontal and he's going to get me. Follow me in here? Not all the way. That's cool. I'm safe right here, I think. Nope, that guy's coming. And then he backs up. Alright. Oh, here we go. I'm here. Venny. Venny? That's. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. This fight's gonna suck. Okay. Oh, yeah. I wanna stay on his right, I think. Wait, his right's over there. Damn it. Smell your junk. It's horrible. Stop. Oh, goodbye, stamina. Well, I know I would be doing double damage if I went and killed the ancient dragon, but the ancient dragon's a cool guy. I don't really feel like killing him. So we'll just all hang out. For now, I guess, until Vendrick hits me with- oh, I can look right up into the butthole. Oh shit! Oh, okay. Oh, that does so much stamina damage. Do some overheads, man. Stop doing that horizontal, it's really lame. There we go. We're chipping him down. Nope. This feels like 
Oh, nope, not nice. going for three. Woo. Slow and steady. I guess if you were just fighting a giant, basically human husk of a person, this is how the fight would go. You just sort of chip at him. Oh shit. No. I can't get behind him. Oh! Oh good, but he doesn't have a follow-up. Oh okay. god. There's the third one I've been waiting for. Oh, stop jumping into the... into the wall! Oh shit. Oh <laughs> man! Oh, I think I need to not be a baby and just two-hand this weapon. Actually, wait a minute. Does it get a strength bonus? Oh, it gets C-scaling with strength, so yeah, it would do more damage. I think this is actually one of those fights where they're like, bring a repair powder. You know what? I'm not going to really have time to use one of these stones, because he'll just kill me. Oh yeah, bright bugs! Forgot about those, I'll use one of those. That'll help make up the difference. I don't remember how long it takes to use those, so we'll find out. But if I can just kit him in that circle again. I know he has another attack. I'm surprised he didn't use it. I'm not complaining that he didn't use it because it's a shitty attack, but still. Now we'll start the fight with this. How long does this take? Oh, that is so long. I don't know if I can use it during the fight. Okay. Okay. That would have killed me. No, oh, fuck, I used two bright bugs. I didn't mean to do that. I thought that was my. Damn it. Gotta just roll through the horizontal. There we go, now we're putting some work in. I don't think a single bright bug makes up for the damage bonus that he currently has, but... I missed with both of those swings. Shit. Can you get out of the corner? Can you stop doing those horizontals, though? Ooh. This bright bug is lasting. Just as I was saying it. Oh shit. Do 
those overheads, please. Again. And you're dead. Woo. I didn't realize I had that many souls on me when I did that. What? Why is I haven't killed Vendrick and Scar the first sin yet? All right. Cool. Well, I guess it's time to become more swole. The swollening continues. Alright. Now it's time to go get the actual final last item for this build. After I level up. trying to do last time. I hope that Outrider Knight is dead. Not Outrider Knight, Dragon Rider Knight is dead. Does, how much magic damage does that stop? Nice. Almost 75%. <laughs> that's a good one. Uh oh. Oh shit, I died. Carelessness. I did think that that little dude was gonna show up. But he did, and he punched me right in the butt. Is that you? Fight me, large golem. Feel my poke spin. Oh, that's a lot of cooldown. But you're dead, so it doesn't matter. And it looks like that knight is dead. Haha. -ha. 
Oh, you missed. Oh, I missed. But not that time. Cool. Now I can just walk right in, sort of. Spin around me. Oh, I didn't spin. Oh, because I ran into waste deep water. Is locked. Oh no, I guess that means I have to become human. Now open up. Shazam! The soul of the king. the king's armor but most important is the crown so I need to decide which crown I like best we'll head to Majula so I can't get invaded I was doing some runs last night to clear out some areas I was getting invaded a lot even when I was dead I think I've gotten too swole, so now I'm attracting people who are like three new game pluses in. Right, so let's see. Classic. That one's okay. That one's too big. That one looks like more of a feminine crown. Uh, let's just go with the king's crown. Alright. So once again, and for the last time, back to the undead ditch. I am the one true monarch. Yes! The rest will follow. So is that actually an item? And can I actually go back in or is that the end of going to his thing? Heat radiates from the ancient crowns. Ah, 
It doesn't look like they gave me anything. Ugh, oh, Vengarl's helmet is so much better. Oh. And I can't go back into his dreams anymore. So, we'll do some quick testing to see if the internet was right. First. Do the big test. I am a human alive and with 15,000 souls. Survey says. I am human and alive still. So yes, once you get all the crowns, you there is no more penalty for dying in terms of like hollowing or and I believe you're also immune to curse. I knew you'd be around. King. You've been long away. Well. Oh, you don't have any chunks I can buy. No, I don't really need to level anything up anymore. Alright. So, CG's magical journey to acquire thingamajigs is over. Now the king. So now begins the bossiest of boss rushes. <laughs> but now the ring of binding is useless. dead on the top floor. Come on, non-capita- oh cool, a salamander is actually dead. What, you're not dead? Shit. <laughs> Still got all these weeaboos to deal with. Ah, oh shit. 
Why are you both here? Also, those dried roots I need to use. All right, it's coming. Who's coming? over with. I gotta kill you all. This is like one of the few times like a setup in a video game like layout makes sense logically but game wise this sucks. Cause, like it makes sense that all of these dudes would stand guard. But uh it makes this run very unfun. Rhyming. Ah, oh, I didn't parry it. Alright, one last one. Bring it on, daddy. Alright. Here we go, Alon. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you on the first try. Katana fight. What? Ugh. Well, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I forgot as he backed up, I was drinking. Like, I think he can clear this whole area and hit me. But it's fine. I don't really die. So we'll try here a little bit. We can go try the challenge rooms. I can just throw myself like a giant meat pile against so many things today. Really, I think if I start getting stuck here, I will probably start trying to do the abyss. Until I get frustrated and say, never mind, we're just finishing the game up because I want to play new stuff tomorrow. Oh, that's so cool you get to stay human. You know what? I'm going to bring a... Uh, Steel wield glory, not into the boss fight, but just to help me clear out dudes so I don't have to worry about it as much. And then I'll just send him home before heading in. care if it's semi-cheating. I want to get this over with. So overall, I think the DLC has a very cool reward for finishing all of it. Like, it just radically changes how the game works. And you only really get to do it for, like, the end of the game, so it also feels fair. Alright, everyone, get them. Hit, hit them. Where's the other one? There you are, go get him. Oh, so yeah, that's that's what the twin blade's gonna look like. Thanks, Matt. 
potatoes. Uh, we'll let you get home and go to bed or whatever you guys do. Send all of them back? I guess not. Alright. Later, dudes. Let's try this again. Fight me, Alon. Blocking. That, yep. I shouldn't have swung at him while he was doing that. Now I know not to drink. He's gonna jump away. sword. That probably would have hurt. That did hurt. I was correct in my assumption. Poise broken. Did it? Yeah. All right. That wasn't too bad. Better than I thought it would go. <laughs> One more smelter wedge. that was the Iron Throne hidden back there so I still have some stuff to do here I have some of those uh, more of those idols to find so we can go do those too well, that went way better than I thought it would I remember he killed me he killed me so many times that I didn't even have to like do extra runs to like kill all of his dudes like by the 14th time they were just all dead anyway
some more endurance. Or what is? Well, let's raise my agility. No. I should probably raise that a little bit more. Alright, let's go stick some smelter wedges in some people. Because I now have all the smelter wedges. I just have to find all of this, the idols. But I honestly don't know where they would be. There's three more. I know where two of them are. Huh, I never went back here. Let's check it out. I'm the king, I can go where I please. Oh, what's this? I wondered where that ring was. I found the other ones. that assassin guy now. It's in the foyer. Oh, I'm immune to curse, so I can just walk right down in there now. Ha <laughs> ha! I don't even have to worry about it. But I still haven't... Oh! And then there's the one that's down there. Okay, so I know where they all are. I just have to find them. Is this the way out? Yes. Dead. And then I'll be able to get the cool thing that's down here. And then I will be truly almost done with this DLC. I was about to be like, then I'd be done, but I forgot I still have. Alright, Maldrin. I also have a shield now. Are you kidding me? Yes! I want to parry you so bad. Yes! Get it! Joke's on you, mofo. You're not going anywhere. Revenge is tasty. Okay, so now I can just... Yep, and I cannot be cursed. Ow. Ow. Okay. Oh shit, are they immortal? There we go. Ah, I might die again, but it's fine. Rude. Rudeness. Someone just blew up. Okay, retreat up a little bit. Are they all gonna follow me the whole way? 
missed. Oh, the guy from up there fell off. Funny. Whoa. Ah, these guys are still pretty strong. Oh, maybe that wasn't a uh, defense increase, it was just. safe down here. I don't think there's any enemies, but I might be wrong. What is this email? No, I don't want to join your poetry contest. Be wary of ambush. Okay, so there is an ambush. I hear sounds. That's not the cool thing. Oh man, I think the Steam Summer Sale just started too. The Majestic Great Sword! Which, for people who don't know, is. The Great Sword of one Artorius. Holy shit, I can power stance these? Oh, because I meet the strength and dex requirements. I was like, what? That's not what I want to do. I don't want to power stance them. There we go. Is you can do crazy stuff like this. Well, bam. I thought you had to put it in your left hand. Oh, maybe it's because I, I don't meet the stats. I can't do all the cool stuff. But yeah, you can do all the neato bedito flips and stuff. There's a sword I was tempted to use, but I've already done a great sword, no shield build in this. All right, and then there's actually one other thing now that I defeated the sword. The the you can live by yourself in that hole. The watcher and defender. I can go get something, but first we're gonna see if we can figure out where the Nishandra idol is and put it out of its misery. And then go do something real quick before throwing ourselves down all of the challenge hallways. I need to go down. Is the down to me? Is Kasuralan was not a challenge hallway boss. He was just the final, final boss of this DLC. And he's really cool, and he gets a really awesome extra death animation if you can kill him without taking a single hit. Which I've seen live one time on a stream, I believe. I thought I saw it. Maybe I'm crazy and didn't see it live, I just saw it. was a playthrough I was watching where someone did it. So wait now. I went the wrong way, I need to keep going down with the key. Not being able to be cursed is really gonna buttfuck Nishandra. 
because that's like her main deal is just DPS curse. Which adds some lore stuff, which is like one of the reasons why Vendrick like maybe ha- oh! There is a high path I didn't notice. Woo! What's this saying? Gorgeous view. Fine work. Good luck. Okay. Is that... Uh, Vendrick sort of resides himself to being there because he couldn't get all the crowns, so he would be vulnerable to the curse. But now that I have every crown... The strength ring. I guess I didn't have the strength ring. What other ring did I find then? Oh well. So now that I have sur surpassed him and he has acknowledged that I have done so, I am able to go get Nishandra. Try lightning back. Are you stand up and attack me? The shorter range of this weapon sometimes gets me. Uh, I missed. But so did he. Voice damage does this do? 35. Is that, wait, is that less? No, the other one, wait. Yeah, we'll... <sighs> Drop attacks in this game are so hard to land. I chose the Dranglaic Sword just because, I don't know, it felt fashion soulsy right because I'm in Dranglaic. I'm becoming the king of Dranglaic by the end of this. There we go, I got it. It's, it's a great sword that a lot of people seem to like, but it is definitely not the best. Wait a minute, where am I? Dang it, I went the wrong way, I think. No, wait, I went the right way. Oh shit, can you follow me? Not forlorn, this is the last thing I needed. Uh, the, uh, the covetous demon? No. Oh, I made a big mistake. Hey, but I got through it. For Smelter Demon, I believe yes, you did. Unless you already beat Smelter Demon. All right, Forlorn, I'll fight you, but I don't want to do it with everyone watching. Oh, everyone's gone. Cool. Are they all gone? I mean, you can. I can stay up there if you want. I thought there was a Nishandra statue here. So this is, I think I'm just down now at the bottom. Yep. Oh, I was like, why is there a fog gate? Did he come back? Alright, so I have to kill Forlorn. Yeah, the Covetous Demon, I don't think she's available to summon in Scholar of the First Sin. To the Covetous Demon. Because I tried to do that too, and then I was like, I can't find her sign anywhere. Where are you, Forlorn? Alright. What? Of course now you see me. After your homeboy's like, oh, he's right there. Hmm. 
What? That goes through shields? That was a ludicrous amount of damage. I'm almost out of Estus. God, that reverse combo does so much. Alright. Fight me again. Thought I have already killed you the number of times I needed to. Nishandra was down, Nish Nishandra, whatever her name was. Now. Try ladder. Dude stayed dead, so maybe she's not down here. Dang. Uh, has Lucatil given you the the Ring of Steel protection plus one, Casanova? Did I get? Did I get? No, I still have a smelter wedge left. Sorry, uh, did she give you the Ring of Steel protection plus one? Okay, then yeah, you're on track for her story then. Yeah, where are you? All these Ashen Idols. Throne floor... The Iron Warrior and four doors behind the third door on the left. Okay, I know I was missing something. Okay, so in the room with the Iron Warrior behind the third door on the left. Head out of the elevator room after the f go left. Take it to the top and then cross the gap using the steel platform that moves up and down. The bottom of the steel platform on the ledge requires a time jump as the pilgrims spawn tune. Alright, let's see if we can figure out what's going on.
have not opened that door. Okay. See the glow. Shit. Door open. Back over here. Back over here. Come back over here. I need to stab your girlfriend. Stop protecting your girlfriend. Finding getting up there was not a problem. I'll just go grab it again. And then I guess it's iron passage time. Which, the key, everyone was like, just summon everyone and then just run it until you get to the boss and then unsummon all your dudes. Summon Luca Teal again until uh, you get to the gutter, and then you'll need to find her. And she's a little bit tricky to find, and that will be the final place you need to use her to fight. Have I explored like everywhere? Battle dance with me, Holmes. Souls and Nishandra. There we go. I have completely destroyed her essence. Life ring plus three. Wait, did I already have that? Titanite shards. Petrified something. A broadsword. Whoa. Alright. Well, only one thing left to do now. In this area. <sighs> I'm sitting on a lot of souls. How close am I to a level? going for about an hour and we're pretty close to finishing about a third of what we're doing so we're on track I think oh god I'm not looking forward to the challenge hallway in I need that I think I have that in the edible souls in the ivory king that one is the one I may just get frustrated and go nope not doing it anymore 
But yeah, the end of the game I think is going to be pretty cakewalkish. Oh yeah, I was supposed to put aromatic ooze on my sword. Oh, it's gonna be a little short. I think. Yep. Uh. Not gonna use Velstat shit. Do I want to eat that? How many souls do I need? 2,000? I can just make that by selling stuff to Gaff. But yeah, when you're having a bit of trouble with the Royal Rat Authority, my recommendation is to get a decent bow and just stand at the door and shoot all the rats with fire arrows if you have them. They will do the most damage. Should have a whole biggity bunch of Alon armor. See if I made some cash. Make way for me, your king. Drop a chunk for me, peasant. Oh, your stupid armor that I don't want. Gablan! Extra am I have now? Many deal. I am six thousand over, so let's buy some poison arrows. These are mean and I love them. Please. No. I forgot how broken the amount of arrows you can carry is in this game. Grab a level. And then to the Iron Passage! Not to the Iron Passage while I'm here, I will do something Those else. Who come to drink, All right, here it is. Perhaps you. There's the agility I'm looking for. All right. Kale. Swing my sword. One, two, three, four, five, and a little bit of a roll. Cool. Perfect, perfect. Hey, Kale. It seems that all the flames have been lit. It 
makes me feel somehow. Wait. What am I doing here? Who are you again? Fate brought us together for a reason. Take these, and may they help you on your travels. Thanks for your stuff. What? I guess I never did that either. Oh, because I just beat the game and didn't talk to him. It seems that it's me. Wait, who are you again? Now, if I take this hat off, do I die? Not die, but. I get to stay a human. Which means I need to kill myself. Whoop. Just go finish up Navland's story. Oh, the other things I did uh, off screen is I did respec a couple times. I went in respect to not be so dumb, so now, uh, Carnelian is here. And then I also went and did all the stuff with the Hex Boy. I finally tracked down my teacher. I need to see Alright, bye. So I have now rounded up the whole squad so everyone's safe and sound. I really like how Dark Souls 2 handles, like, allies. Yeah, we'll start out here. I like that they all just kind of stay here. And unlike Dark Souls 1 and 3, by the end, you don't just help them all to death. Which, I get if it's trying to make an artistic statement, but it always just bothered me as a gamer, because I'm like, I'm doing the things to help, why are you hurting me? By taking away my friends. But, I still really love those games, so I can't be too mad. So, if I put the hat back on, I'll test it later, I don't want to have to go kill myself again. I'll just do all this shit, but I would be really mad if I didn't bring the thing with me. Yes. Simpleton Spice. Let's discuss our thing. I want you to kill one. Your target is Felkin the Hexer. As proof of proof. What do you say? Sure. Yes, but he will be formidable. Nope, he won't. I'll just prove that I'm really smart and he'll give me a shit. This is my thanks. Forbidden Son, that's a really good hex. Feather. Yes. That's the feather. God. Your reward. What do you require? You've been good to me. Nice. Now he is a store. I can buy the the wow. I can buy a goofy outfit I've never had access to before. Oh, this is how you get the witch's outfit. Thunder quartz ring. I don't I think I have to deal with anyone who does lightning. Those stupid reindeer do. Great arrows. These are for you. Oh, he's oh he just fucking gives you the chaos set. Alright, so let's see what First, let's just test. If I put the hat on, does it bring me back to life? Nope. Boom. Now let's see what his human half says. I haven't said anything. I have absolutely do not attempt to help me. Just, just leave me alone. Leave this. All right. Please. Please. 
Dude, I already fixed you. Stop being so angry. I guess you're not being angry, you're just freaking out. And cool. They'll just sit in that hole. While I go to another hole. Ugh. Coming for you, Iron Passage. Me and the whole crew. I don't even remember who. I think you can summon Vengarl for that one again. Yep. Alright, here we go. Uh, time for sadness. Oh, Iron Hallway. Oh, let's go the Iron Passage. Have I been just crazy this whole time? Oh, it's Iron Passage. Okay. Here we go! Alright, Steel Wheeled Leary, you were pretty alright before, and who's this? Drifter, Swordsman, oh, it's just you guys again. Sure, let's all go. We'll all work together. We're not gonna pull that switch. Oh, that freaked me out. I wasn't ready for that. One down. Ah, priest dudes. Oh, you bitch. Ow, that collectively hurt very much. Oh, well, I fell down too far. Everyone, come on. guys. One, two. Alright. I think this is the last room. What a fool. Did he drop Sucks. 
damn, I'd be like, how is he going to cast through this? That was bananas. Okay, so now we are at a tiny bit of a problem. There's the door. Smelter hammer? That's pretty good. Wow, that doesn't really... Can you be poisoned? Doesn't look like it. it makes sense, you're like a weird ghost person. Alright, well... <sighs> Luckily, I'm in a safe place and get rid of my dudes. than I wanted to. Well, we're at the boss fight, so... You know what? I have dried mushrooms, I'm gonna use them. Here we go. Let's see how good you are, other smelter demon. There's nothing to stop me from just running that. Let's just try that. I just thought about it. I didn't have to pull any switches or anything. There we go. I may have to burn an Estus when I get in the room. Peaceful walk of peace, or whatever that stupid spell that he's casting. I really just just another smelter demon boss fight. I've already done this. We'll give it a couple more goes, and then I'll just put it meh. I don't care. He gives you a sword that I cannot use. Wow, those don't really heal at all. Well, fuck you. Wow. Well, those dried mushrooms suck. I thought they were going to be better than the old Radiant Life Gems, considering there's, like, a finite number of them. No, the thing I do want to do is, uh... Oh, man, I don't have to use... Do I have to use humanity at all to keep doing this? I probably still have to. There we go. 
pop on some life gems. We're gonna head and we're gonna do uh, the Abyss Walkers. That's something that's fun. And has a really cool boss fight. That's new, because all of the challenge hallways are just boss fights that have already been in the game. There's this one, which is just Smelter Demon, but now he also does magic damage. So, oh, I can see all of you now. That's cool. I forgot that I have that eye. Hey, guys. Uh, yeah, the challenge hallway that I had done recently when I was playing with Will. That's just three dudes. So it's like cool dude fighting, and then the the challenge hallway for the other one is just uh, the cat, but plus another one. All right, here's a human effigy. go. I can't remember which one of these is like the best one to do because this this whole covenant I know I whine about it. I still love this game. I like it more than one but not as good as three. So there's so many cool ideas but with every cool idea there's like one really not cool thing that they do. So what's in this one? I'll say that later is that's just a drop into the abyss. Why are you buffed? Do you see me? That guy does. Lightning again. Hey, you, you come in, come in here. What are you doing? Yes, the fool. All right. Is I poison you guys? Can haha. -ha. There we go. That's one down. All right. You have a buff from something. Who are you supposed to be? You look like you were just wearing the starting gear. Oh, I forgot about the heavy combo that just flows into itself. Alright. So, what you do in all these chasms is... Where's the flame butterfly? You just have to get in here, and then light each one of these braziers. Now, I believe... I, I don't know if you have to make it to the end. I'm assuming you do. Probably just go buy some more light gems, but I'm not going to keep them that All that coffee. I'll get out of here and use the restroom. Go to the other ones. Is you complete all three of these abyss. Is, I guess, abyss walks, whatever they are. And then when you would normally exit, is it just you? I think it's just you. You're not dead. What the fuck? You have toxic. Is yeah. So you have to kill everyone. The door will open, and then there's a big hole in the ground. So now I have finished that abyss. And then there are two more. 
So I have joined. I have deepened my rank. existed from times long. What once was a great void of darkness became but fragments. But fragments. Ha 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 ha. fragments grow, absorbing all things. It is we who will be pilgrims. That one was really easy, so this might be the one I come back to do is... Alright, got a hex I don't care about. Alright. May the dark. Uh, let's get out of here. Head back to my jewels so I can use the bathroom. Ah, uh, you can't poison me. How's that feel? I mean, curse me. Hey, lion man. Oh, you don't even do that much damage from my shield. Delicious. Is after you've lit all three braziers, you have to then run one more of them again, and when you would normally drop out and start a new fight, you drop down to the boss area. And the boss is really cool, but it's just really annoying that you have to kill everyone in the thing. You can never just run it, which makes it really hard for, like, magic classes. And I'll explain why after I get back to the restroom. still alive oh. but the last time I was doing playing this game I was playing as a priest class because it's normally not something I do but we were doing a big group run with Will and Evan and I wanted to do like support healing and stuff but the finishing the, the whatever they're called the pilgrims of the dark or pilgrims of the abyss or whatever gives arguably the best chime in the whole game but trying to do it solo was really hard because I was more offense magic than I was just hit people with big sticks so to save all of my big hits oh, I'm gonna get poisoned probably Haha, ha, jokes on you. I'm a ninja. Oh no! Haha, ha, double jokes on you. Well, son of a bitch. Too far! Is I needed to revert to hitting people with sticks when I wasn't really built for it. So then, either I would die from being too squishy and not that good at this game. Or I would burn all of my spells, killing all of the dudes to open the boss door, and then have nothing for the boss, and then get killed there. And I do believe that the abyss is, even in like normal mode, or one of, I need to put on that poison thing, so I don't get super poisoned and have to use Estus. But. Rude. Yep. No, did it anyway. Oh well. These aren't too bad. Fine. Yeah, if I was saying anything. Yeah. No. Alright, open that for me, my dude. It was just really frustrating and oh the thing I'm saying is the abyss, I believe, is even when you're not a member of the Covenant of Champions, a run made the dark. That the and oh my goodness, can you stop being so loud up there? A place where if you run it 12 times, the enemies stay dead. Like, they just will respawn infinitely. So it doesn't do the Dark Souls 2 thing of, well, even if I suck, if I just keep bashing my head against it, eventually the wall will break. 
the wall just keeps rebuilding itself and taking all of your lunch money. Alright, so we got that guy. Oh, is that a turtle guard? Hey, turtle guard. freaking out. I thought there was a magician up here. Wait, are there two of you? Oh, you have two hammers. Ow, you hurt me. What a hit. So as you could guess, fighting a dude like this while trying to keep your... Oh, he's not a turtle guard, he's a dude dressed as a turtle. While trying to keep your magic from being used as a magic person was a little frustrating because you just, just got beat up real bad. Uh, okay, so we got another guy. What does that do? Well, it didn't stop me from killing you, so it's fine. Does he have a buff on him? No. Oh, hey, it's Pyromancy Man. Is that everyone down there? Like, can I come down and beat you up? Oh, your poise sucks. Definitely do not feel the need to run this one again. Visions of danger zone. There's the brazier. Does really no one try to stop me? Nice. Alright, look for anyone sneaking up behind me. Nope. I have more than enough flamey butterflies. And then I guess the other thing that also sucks about the zone is, I think, I don't know if it's true anymore, if it's in Scholar of the First Sin, but you could get invaded while you were in here, so on top of all of the other shit, people who just knew that this was going to be a PvP zone would just ruin. Alright, so who's here? Another turtle boy. There's my poison. Enjoy it. Enjoy my poison. I made it for you. I think he's dead. Yeah, that's gonna kill him. Bye. Drinking with confidence. And then it's a pyro boy. Hey, but you can come up here though, I'll kick your ass, that's fine. That's a big fire explosion. Oh, you're bad at this. I forgot. With these swords, you want to just keep comboing the same attack type over and over again. You don't really want to switch it up. And that's all these guys, so that's two down. Quick and easy, super cheesy. Maybe your covenant doesn't deepen with every single one. Maybe it's one and then three. 
Either way, let's head back to Majula and we'll buy some more life gems. I wish she sold bigger life gems. But I lit that. Yeah, I lit that thing. So, Majula. just do this because it might take a while and then we'll just finish the game. Alright, so just to check. Pilgrims of Dark. Yep. Let's clear all three. And then the final one is defeat the final boss. Ooh. Life gems, please. It'd be cool if you sold bigger ones. On you. Wow, bright bugs have gotten really expensive. Thanks. Oh, I had a perfect amount of money. All right, and then luckily this one, which I, don't, I can't remember which one is the best one. I think the one back in the shaded woods is best one to run for just how easy it is especially for me but this one has a bonfire next to it so if I keep getting killed by a boss in here it'd be really nice to be able to do this run. Oop, oh, ran the wrong way. How strong am I against this guy? He swung right through me and missed. Nice. Alright. Oh no this one has Havel and stuff in it. I definitely don't want to do this one. Yeah. Over and over again. The most of the Here's a human effigy. All right. All right, have a one v one me. Yeah, I think when I was doing it one time, I got invaded here, and I got my butt. Punched surprisingly hard. All right, have a vivel. A vivel, come on. Have a. Have come fight me. I think, if I remember correctly, and it's kind of funny. I think Havel will kill himself because his pathfinding is really jacked up. Pathfinding was pretty good. Ow. That hurt a lot. Okay. Smashing me a bunch, Havel, I don't like it. Now I'm worried I'm in a bad spot to fight you. Don't. Oh, okay, we're good. Come on, Abel. Do the thing you do sometimes. And fuck up and fall in the hole. Or don't, I guess. worst part of this one, but I know there's a few, like, legendary heroes in this one. Right, I don't think there's any of the little magic dudes who help them, but I might be wrong. And now I burn through effigies. You can't follow me in here, right? Yeah, your AI tells you to stop. I am not young. The most of you. Yes. Nope. There. The most Give him an effigy.
We'll try this a little straighter this time. If I could get a parry, that would be really cool. There's a little magic dude here. Anyone else? Nope. Alright. Just gotta light this up. Cool, cool. all three of them, so now I just have to get out of here without dying. And then I will be the most pilgrim. John Wayne will be so proud of me. Oh, hello. Ow, Ricard, that hurts. But not as much as this. For you, good sir. I think this last person's a bow user. So she's about to have a bad time. Okay, am I going the right way? Nope, I looped back around. Alright, so Rickard, Havel, and I think this is. No, Ferris was in the other one. This is just a thief lady. Or is she a hex lady? She's a shuttle lady. Fall in that hole! Fall in it! Come on! Do it on the stream! That was a lot of damage. Well, that wasn't too bad. And now I can leave! Oh, we got five viewers. Hey, everyone. Just, uh... Clear in the abyss. Just casual Tuesday abyss clearing here on Good Game. Oh shit, what the fuck? Oh no. I didn't think it went right into it. Okay, here we go. Oh no. I know that thing's gonna come out of there. Oh. That was decent damage. Ow, my bones. Could you not? Uh, okay, okay, what do you do up there? I was not prepared for this. No, not that move. Stop throwing the sun at me. This is kind of going okay. Okay. Laser beam, laser beam. Double laser beam. You're gonna land first. I just don't think you are. Explosion time, now. Well, I didn't expect to win this fight on my first go. Ooh, that hurt. Oh, I think I'm gonna die. Roll, 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 roll. 
Woo! Come on! Well, shit. Okay. Where's the other one? What do you do? Ah, oh, fuck. Whoop, whoop. Uh, where'd you go? Where's the other one? What are you doing? So the other one went. Oh no! Please drink. But responsibly, if you could. Okay, so we got sun. Luckily, they're both doing this, so I can just run inside. Oh my god, I can't believe I did that. Woo! All right. Ah! With, I think I came in with six Estes. Left with one. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Ugh. Well, you know what? I think we're just gonna go finish the game after this. That felt really good. I knew that you were special. <sighs> and is that Setian and? Oh, hey, Stu. I'm Stu Neely. Is that how you say it? I'm sorry. Thanks for following, by the way. It really means a lot. We're getting close to being an affiliate. I bequeath these to you. I wish I had that in my other character, who really needs a good chime. All right. Well. May the dark shine your way. Ugh. Call him off screen, guy. I just want people to be called whatever they want to be called here. Ugh. All right. Well. Let's go you know, for one more level. I am short by like 600. I think I have a little crappy soul I can eat. I don't know if that's enough. Oh, come on. I'm gonna go sell something to Gavlan and get one more level. It'll be the final level before heading in to defeat Dark Souls 2 and hopefully get the secondary ending. I think I've met all the requirements for it. But, oh. Man, after getting smacked by Dark Lurker in my other playthrough for like three hours, getting on my first run, that feels good. But I'm also 
in the lore of my Dark Souls world, probably the beefiest boy in the universe, so... I can't really humble brag too hard. It's what happens when you just sit on the couch eating a endless soul toastinos. Hey, so what do I get? Sell that stupid hammer. Uh... Bip, 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 bip. I have all these destructive great arrows. I don't need that many. Get rid of those. Also don't. I think that's enough. Also just sell these, I don't need them. Get out of here. One arrow. Good to go. One more level of probably bigger. Whoa. And then go beat up Nishandra. And now that I'm immune to curse, she's gonna have a time of it. this up. And then I can go buy some games at the Steam Summer Sale. <sighs> Here we go. Tiny pokes are ineffective. What, that didn't kill you? That did. Right. That's right, I am the symbol of the king. Open your doors to me. really any problems with her, but just if we die, just having to keep doing this run. I guess I also need to find wherever Benhard is, since I finished his quest, and he'll give me his sword that I can't use. I don't remember where he ends up. Because I've done three boss fights with him. Well, we'll find out later. Sits in one of. Oh, okay. Thank you for that, Sedian. If I'm saying your name wrong, please let me know. Oh, I also need to go talk to Drummond again. I haven't talked to him again. Oh, there's a different cutscene if you come in when she's already here. I didn't know that. Looks like a predator had sex with Nito. Oh, I will be one with all that darkness. All right, let's do this. Oh boy. Oh. Eh, it still hurts. It's not nothing damage. Whoa! Those poison you? I thought they cursed you. Shit, that's actually hurting me. Okay. 
I got too ahead of myself on this one. I thought they just cursed. Oh, that's lame. That one's just out in the middle of nothing. Man, you can't hit me with your laser beams. Wow, I was like right in front of you three times. Roll. And it only does physical. Oh boy. I don't think you were prepared for this fight, Nishandra. What are you doing? Are you just making your stupid little pain babies? I will pirouette them into non-existence. Uh, I'm not gonna risk the swing of that one. Are you gonna blow up? Yes, you are. like to be dead. So, if I know correctly, yes. Nope. Many mothers have come and gone. One drowned in poison, another was charming today. That indeed was quite easy peasy. Not one of them stood here. As you do. You, conqueror of adversities. That's me. It was your answer. Oh, shit. Are we fighting right now? Hey, bud. Oh, I can lock on to you now. Wait, why are we fighting? Me. I have a near infinite. So oh god, what are you doing? Okay, okay, okay. Are you healing? You're not healing. I almost sprinted off the edge. Oh, do you not move? Okay, you do move. We'll teleport away. That's cheating! Oh, that thing turns. Alright, throw your whatevers. Oh, he's gonna start. Oh, those hit a lot. Oh no. Sprint, please. Alright. 
Wait, so now do I just have to hit him while he's constantly on super fire? Okay. That's doable. I like this staying alive thing. Thank you very much. That is why I like Twitch, it is just meeting cool people who are into the same games as you. Alright, at least now I can go in with full Estus. Ah, oh, just clenched the open door. And, uh, full weapon degradation. Well, full weapon health, I guess. Is he hitting me with fire and dark? I feel like he is. So I will put on... Put on that ring instead, because he doesn't really hit me with anything physical. Thanks, man. I heard you guys defeated Covetous Demon in your guys' playthrough. Oh, are you guys streaming right now? If you are, I'll hurry up and finish this so I can catch your thing. Wait, who's this third one? Oh, Bradley the old guard. Alright, Aldi, let's do this again, you old fuck. Did you stop being on fire? I also wish the game sprinted when I told it to sprint every time. Oh, that thing just boomeranged back and almost hit me. Oh, that one did hit me. So watch out for his teleports. Stop being on fire now, that was the rule. less damage after a second. fire so I can hit you now. Now ah, where are you going over here? Come on. 
<laughs> ah, idiot! Sounds pretty cool. So I can go over there. Or. Because that is the normal ending. But you know what? I've been king long enough to realize that it kind of sucks. So I'm going to go adventure some more. Keep this, this crown though. It's pretty neat. Arthur memes. That's what we got. Thanks, man. So that's sort of a mirror of the dark ending of Dark Souls 1. But I think it's going to do credits now, right? So, ah, that is Scholar of the First Sin. Now, I didn't go beat the three optional, not really that fun bosses in the DLCs, because I just didn't really want to, because they're not that fun. But, ah, I really think Scholar of the First Sin was a really great update to a game that had a lot of good ideas, but then not some not great ideas that the community didn't really like, and it ends up getting buried as like this Dark Souls B team game for noobs. But I don't know. Especially the way they handle the Dragon Area in this game, which I won't spoil for people who haven't gotten there yet, is. Uh, that might be my favorite thing in all of Dark Souls. This is in this game, and we finished it in a little under 40 hours, which is, I think, the fastest I've ever beaten this game. We've only beaten it two other times, though, so. It's not saying a whole lot. But I really appreciate everyone who uh, stopped by after time, time Casanova. We got set and then. I'm sorry, I still don't quite know how to say your name, other Kyle. But. Ugh. Really makes me want to go back and finish that Dark Souls 3 playthrough we started, but. I don't know, I think we'll take a break from Dark Souls for now. And hopefully there are some good deals in the Steam store when I get out of here, and maybe we can. Start exploring 14th century Bohemia, and we can all learn how to read together. Or uh, maybe, maybe Dead Souls, or was it Dead Dead Cells? That's what it is. Will be on sale, and we can uh, do some 2D roguelite platforming. Uh, I know one game that would be cool, Kyle. If you uh, wanted to get that one, is that we plan to do? Is that uh, do you have Gang Beasts? That is a really fun fake fight. It's not really a fighting game with like combos and stuff, but it is a great party game that has made many laughs in my belly. And uh, they have online multiplayer now. I actually haven't played online multiplayer. I heard it's it's decently fine. So that should be fine. Uh, I'm trying to think if there are any other games on Steam that are co-op fun to play. Did you ever end up getting uh, Rainbow Six Siege when it was on sale? Ha. Hmm. Well, that's a bummer. 
that's fine. Though. That's still a really popular game. We'd probably just get buried. Robert has been bringing up this game called Ultimate Chicken Horse a bunch. Which is a pretty fun party game where... Do you know about it? I guess before I just explain it to no one. It's this, like, competitive with a slight cooperative element platforming game where it's... You have a starting point and then an ending point, and then everyone has like a turn before they start playing where they get to lay down physics out not physics objects, platforming objects like platforms and traps and then you run it and it's the first person to get through the obstacle course you've built and I think how it works is if no one gets through like in 30 seconds everyone gets to add another object and it's just this weird game of fighting trying to build a good level of platform but also trying to like dick over your opponents by like putting really cheap things and it's a really good couch co-op game. Because you can just kind of reach over and smack your friend for putting all of the crossbows pointing at the entrance. But if that gets fairly cheap, like about five bucks, I'll probably pick it up. Because that could be some fun stuff. I don't know if we talked about it at all, but do you have any interest in uh, playing uh, Path of Exile? Is that the final credit? Is it? Oh, never mind. It's like Korean translator. That's normally not the last thing. As I know. The guys here got me turned on to the Diablo games with Diablo 3, and I've heard that Path of Exile at this point now is just a better version of Diablo 3. Another one, which I'm sure it's going to go on sale pretty hard if you're willing to deal with some jankiness, is uh, Fallout 76. That has gotten a lot better. If you like Fallout games. We've... Hard pass. <laughs> uh, we've played, we played with like a group of five. It was... Uh, I can't remember who all it was. It was I think it was Rob... Me, Evan, Zach. I can't remember who the f I thought there was a fifth one, and even when there was some jank, it was still a lot of fun just running through areas and beating up dudes. <sighs> some other good ones. I don't know if you heard of this game, it's called Destiny. It's pretty okay, there's a lot of grinding in it. But I've heard some people say it's cool. going uh, free to play in September so maybe that's something to think about as time goes on okay well from I, I've known you long enough I think I think you'd like it uh, yeah it's made by a pretty small company called Bungie uh, they did this really old game called Halo I don't know what it really is about like evolution or something the character named like Master Chef. It might be a cooking game. I don't know. People tend to like that one. Will talks about it sometimes, all the time. That's pretty weird. But in a more serious note, have you heard whether or not uh, Iceborne is going to be free? Will was looking, and a lot of people are talking like it's going to... It def is not okay. Okay, I was under the understanding that all DLC, when they, like, announced it coming out, was going to be free. And then, yeah, Will was talking the other day... That it's like, nope. It's a bunch of money, and I was like, oh, okay. Oh, yeah, I never joined the Blue Sentinels. Man, after the stream, we might hit uh, three concurrent viewers. And then all we need is 12 more followers. Two more followers for the great ranching to begin. Found some nice recipes to make some uh, pretty tasteful ranch shooters for Will to enjoy during uh, the stream once we are in the stretch for the last 10. 
he's not happy about it at all. But all right, that might be the end. Nope. Hey, Hidetaka Miyazaki, you you did a good job supervising this game. All right, now we're at the end. Whoa, this game was copyright. Wait, no. Okay, so this copyright game didn't come out in 2001. These are just different copyrights for different things. All right. You know what? We're gonna finish up here. I'll go talk to Ben Hart, and we'll go talk to Drummond, and then we'll lay this beast to bed. Until Will's like, help me finish my playthrough, and then I'll be like, but I'm a bajillion levels higher than you. Yeah, that's one thing I also don't like at all, is the soul memory system in this game kind of sucks. Dark Souls 3 nailed it, and that's why. Actually, I guess I was in Bloodborne first, the whole pass the pass word system. So do I just show up in Majula? I am the heir. I do! Alright. Does anyone say anything cool? Bearer of the until her. That tiny thing inside the room at eight no. you, provided you find her on a good day. Alright, well you have a good day. And if you want to watch some uh, some other goofiness later, we'll be on at about like 6:45, I think, is when we're doing uh, our next yeah. session of Fallout New Vegas. Well, All right. these stones make some some none of. Maybe try to get those uh, three other friends, you know, or two other. I don't know if other Kyle was one of them. You should have. Yep, infinite chunks, which I don't need, so it's fine. No interest. So. Begin journey two to Dream Lake. Alright. All of these souls under the character who's there. I think. No, he's not in this one. He is in the other they're in the other two. Which are both accessible through here. Big beefy meat tank. Dead. Oh, I can't quite kill you through your shield. Oh, I guess you're technically damaging me. Alright. Oh. Coming down after all this has been. Fun. I was expecting like what was gonna happen. I'm still pleasantly surprised. <laughs> That's true. All right, Drummond should be here. Hey, bud. Take these. Oh. Hey, bud. out of here and then go ahead to the other memory with Ben Hart and get his sword and be like nah dog the sword sucks okay that's this way I don't remember where it was Boop. Had some people on here when I was streaming near the start who were threatening to invade me with their level 99 dex characters. And I was like, I'm never gonna get that strong, you'll never be able to invade me. But now I am. And they can. Wow, that doesn't kill him in one hit. I'm surprised. There. Am I being followed? No. Ben Hart! Hey, 
here. He would have moved out of... Oh, you're in the tree. Moved out of here once I beat the memory. But there he is. Alright. Hey, bud. Oh, what? I did three boss fights with him. I thought that's all you had to do. Hmm. I guess I'm mistaken. Can you, I could just... No, I would miss him. I was like, could you just shoot him? So yeah, I got him with the Thornwasher Defender, Prowling Magus, and then the Looking Glass Knight. count because I aged fat no he died does it not count because he died during the thing after we beat the throne watcher and defender hmm. well whatever these three boss fights we can summon for and he stays alive until the boss is defeated yeah he survived all three Summon for any DLC ones. I'm wondering if the game didn't count the Throne Watcher and Defender fight because of the other thing. Alright, well, that's kind of a little bit of a fart. But I guess I just looked it up. All he says is, Ha! We did it! Take these! And he just gives you a bunch of garbage. So. So, uh, thanks again for uh, everyone who stopped by and followed during the playthrough. It really means a lot as we make our way towards being affiliate. And I hope uh, the next game I pick, which will most likely be Kingdom Come Deliverance, will grab your interest enough to stop by and hang out with me again during the morning streams. Uh, until that time, I hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you guys tomorrow with hopefully something brand new. <laughs> You guys have a good one.